so we're just on our way to Ferran Wheeler's summer cross. First cross race since about January, so yeah, let's go. Okay, so here we are. This is the summer cross round one. I've already finished round two, but I couldn't be able to do the editing. So I'm only just getting around to do it about a week and a half later. But yeah, it's a it's a hard course. It's very bumpy. And I just decided to film on the GoPro because I feel like when it's being filmed by someone else, you don't get the rider's perspective and you can't see the course and how bumpy or how technical or just how steep anything is. So I filmed this. I filmed most of the course, but I didn't want to make the video too long, so I don't have all of the videos. I've just got little clips. Yeah, so it's it feels like a really hilly course, but there's actually barely any elevation because on Strava it says you do about 70 meters of elevation the whole time. And then I saw the tiles, I was practicing them, and I did a pathetic burp. Ah. Amateur. And I was taking the mick out of Tom. He had a really good ride. He got second just behind me. Oh my god. And there's me getting chopped by um what's his name? Oh yeah. By little miles. I remember this. And then here Wait, we what? got a bit confused because one of the marshals said Excuse that we had the me. How do we get to course, that? But it was just is that being our course? We had the proper course. Oh okay. Yeah, so can we try that bit? We're under 14, under 16. Oh, okay. Oh. But yeah, we got a bit confused and we thought we were only doing a really short course. But in the end, we figured it out. And so it we was get the right. under 12 course. So, yeah. We can do so many laps. And this is just the last section. This is where the sprint would, well, this is where the start of the sprint would be if you came in with another rider. I'll get you the sprint. And just after this, I went to do another yeah. lap. But I didn't realise there was another race starting, so I didn't actually get to do it. But yeah, it's a good course. It's very dry because it's summer cross, obviously. Yeah, I really enjoyed it. Watch this wheelie. I also had a good race. Here's me doing a wheelie. Oh. Yeah. So, into the race. Oh, I need a poo. Let's go. Not a good time. Do you reckon I can hop this? No. Oh, I can do this. So, here's the start. It was weird. Well, there wasn't really any gridding, but the under-16s were front row and then the under-14s were second row because we all sat at the same time. But I managed to move up. At this point, James, an under-16, is already off the front and I'm just... I'm leading the under-14s at the moment. I'm just behind Louis, who's also an under-16. And I get... I noticed that I've got a bit of a gap to the under 14, so I got on the front, but I didn't want to do too much work because it is quite a wind. It was quite windy. I'll say that, and I'm still on the front, but yeah. And then Tom, Charlie, and Miles just about to catch us up, and through the hurdles, I decided I decided that I'd be in front for the hurdles because then you get a gap, and on the race. A couple of days ago here, I didn't have very good positioning and I got boxed in a lot of times. But yeah, they they hadn't mowed the grass yet and it was very bumpy. So the especially on the hills, it was just very slow because on the other race we did. The, so it, currently it's about a week and a half after this race. I just haven't really got around to editing it. But last Tuesday, there was a race here. And they mowed the grass and we averaged about 5k an hour quicker just because it was less like resistant. And then here I attacked. So I didn't do the hurdles very well. I was absolutely knackered. And then here's just another perspective. And you can see the gap that I've opened up. Do this in quite a lot of races. Just hop the hurdles and then try and hang on. So I had a, an alright gap. And then there's Josh, he's an under 16 and just caught me up. And the guy in the red on the white bike, that's Tom. He was the second under 14. All the other under 14s are gone now. But I just opened up a gap to him. That's why I was on the front. I just wanted to go my pace and just try and hold that, hold that gap. And I'm just on the front here. And then he'd drop me. I decided... 
just wasn't worth it because he's not in my race, so it doesn't really matter. But for the hurdles, I want to hop them. But I knew that I'd close the gap anyway, so I just wanted a free space for the hurdles, and I caught him back up. But he dropped me soon anyway. So word on Josh for the second, and then I got managed to get the win. Yeah. Well done. Thanks for sir. watching. See you in the next one.